Now, I read that your wife is the main person who encouraged you to jump into entertainment and to leave medicine behind for a bit. Is that true? Yeah, I mean, she was. It. it she was definitely. Uh, I, I finished uh, filming Knocked Up. I actually filmed it um, still working my day job, and so uh, during a vacation week, and she saw how how a big a deal that that was, and. It was almost like a, a college coach telling the star player to go pro. It's like, it's, uh. it's like, if he, and if anything, uh, ironically, I was the one most reluctant. I actually kind of liked my lifestyle because I had a very, uh, very stable job and I was making good money and it was very stable and it was great benefits. It was like amazing. So it was kind of like, it was hard for me because, but it was my wife's, you know, real encouragement. Like she, she knew like I was really, I was really affected in a good way by filming Knocked Up because that was the, you felt, you knew that was your big break. You yeah. just knew it, even if the movie hadn't come out, even the movie hadn't come out, you just knew it was something, something special. And she was like, yeah, if you don't quit now, you'll never quit. And then you, I don't want you resenting anything, you know, you just sure. don't want to have any regrets in life. And that's, you know, I, I really owe it all to my wife in many ways. So what else has she been right about then? Nothing, <laughs> nothing else. <laughs> nothing ever since. <laughs> Oh man! No, um, <laughs> um, you better clean that up real quick. <laughs> we're gonna cut that, right? I got thirty-eight dollars to cut that footage. <laughs> no, my wife was. Uh, she she really is. It's funny. I I run ideas by her all the time. Like it's funny on the show. Like she's like become this unofficial consultant. I'll, I'll ask her for ideas and 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 I'll run but run ideas by her. Like is this funny? Is this, or and she's so cool about like pulling stuff from real life. She is not, she's just not uptight about anything. She's just like, you know, it's, it's, I, I have, I'm so fortunate to have the kind of wife where, like Joel McHale would say, like, I like your wife much better than you. You know, it's <laughs> like, I, I really married well. I really lucked out, man. So I, I have, like, she's my best friend and she's my partner. Well done. Yeah, yeah. Well, during some of the promos for Dr. Ken, like, we see you in between a woman's legs as you're, like, checking on her private parts right, right, and right. then you put your head on up and you'll say a little something and, and go back yeah. down. How did you film that? <laughs> we get specific. Very carefully <laughs> we shot that. Um, that was actually a very, it, it was, you know, I, I really have to thank the network because their, their promo department, they're really just having so, they're really allowing me to have so much fun doing these promos. I've had so I've had like the most wonderful summer. Like we're writing episodes in Dr. Ken, and then, and I'm getting to do these like really cool promos, and <laughs> even during the NBA Finals, and just doing these POV campaigns. It has been so much fun, and they're just kind of letting me, really just letting me do my thing. And I, I, I'm just so I'm just so grateful. I mean, this is it's, yeah, it's, it's beyond surreal. Dude, like I mean, you're the gratitude that you have. Like this is awesome. I hope it catches on to everybody in well, the industry. Thanks, it's no, perfect. I think because I came from another world and yeah. another in another profession, and you just realize like you know life is short, and you sure. just kind of just kind of gotta gotta own it, you know. Yeah.